It's day 21 of my series, 30 Ways in 30 Days. This week I've been talking about supplementation, and yesterday I talked about magnesium, particularly magnesium malate for migraine. Today I wanted to talk to you about what I think is the second most important nutrient to supplement with if you have migraine, and that is riboflavin or vitamin B2. Now riboflavin is really important in the body because it's critical to the energy production pathway in our mitochondria. So if you don't have enough riboflavin, you're not gonna be able to produce healthy energy. So um, uh, studies have shown that particularly in migraine, uh, people have uh, issues with their mitochondrial energy production. So there are studies that have shown that riboflavin supplementation in migraine can benefit. There are actually three studies that have been published. The first study was published back in 2004, and that study used 400 milligrams of, mag of riboflavin for three months, and those patients improved in their severity and frequency of their migraine. The second study looked at kids and teens, and they, um, they got 200 milligrams of riboflavin, and they also benefit benefited. The third study was in 2017, and it looked at riboflavin, 400 milligrams versus placebo for three months, and guess what? The riboflavin group benefited. So the bottom line, use riboflavin as a supplement at least for three months if you have migraine. Now, um, if you're looking for a good supplement with, with, with both magnesium, malate, and riboflavin, please check out my new supplement line called Ageless by Dr. Rani, and this is Calm. This is specifically formulated for migraine. The link is 